Hi everyone, this is my Muslim Base review. Um, Muslim Base is a UK based company <coughs> that I found the other day and I can't believe that there's no reviews for it on YouTube at all. It's amazing to me. I've been looking for a hijab for about two years now, um, that, or, well since I started wearing hijab, that was one piece long and you didn't have to wear an underscarf with it. And I haven't been able to find one. I've ordered, I ordered two other ones from eBay. One turned out, turned out to be a child's hijab, so that didn't impress me. And the other one was an Almira, which just didn't have the length that I wanted. I wanted one that was going to be really long, like I said, no underscarf or anything, so that basically something I can put on really quickly to answer the door. And if there was ever an emergency, like one of the kids had to be taken to hospital or anything like that, I had something that I could just put on really quickly and not have to worry about coverage or pins or anything like that. Something that I could also sleep in if I had to. I know that sounds weird, but if you've got kids, you'll understand that, you know, when you go to hospital, you don't want to leave them. So anyway, I looked everywhere and I, I couldn't find a hijab like that and then I found one and I was so happy. This is the hijab. I've actually got another hijab on underneath this one because I'm making another video after this and I didn't actually think that wearing the hijab would be a good idea. So it is really long. It comes to my waist, just, or just below my waist. Um, I'll just move the camera so you can see. That's where it comes on me. If you can see, this is obviously my lap, it cut, and that's how long it comes at the back as well. It is so like like so long, and that's with another hijab on underneath. I'm quite a big girl. I'm a size 16, and I'll tell you my bra size. It's a 38F. That's how much coverage you've got basically. So if you've got a big chest, you don't have to worry about the fact that you're not going to you know be properly covered, <clears throat> which I know is what a lot of you know larger ladies have you know sort of issue with the packaging was just purple you know plastic it was well wrapped so there was no chance of anything you know leaking onto it or anything like that i actually ordered the i ordered an abaya as well which i'm also going to show you i ordered the wrong size abaya and it was really small i ordered the 14 to 16 when i needed the 16 to 18 and i this is the only problem that i actually have with the company i emailed them and got a response telling me what size i would need um but then I, I emailed them again to ask what address to send it back to and I didn't get an, a response. I emailed them again and still didn't get a response and started to panic. I messaged them on Facebook and got a response straight away. By this time I was really worried because it was over the 10 days that you could send the, you know, your products back for a return. But there was no issue with it. They never even mentioned it. I think it was about £2 to send the abaya back and they didn't charge me to send me a new abaya which I thought was really good because there's some companies that they'll obviously they won't charge you for the product that you're returning but they will charge you for the postage to send it to you to send you the new one so you wind up paying postage three times you know after you've had it sent and then you've sent it back and you've had it sent again but they didn't you know that they they just sent it to me and they sent me the right size and I absolutely love it I'm so impressed the website it can be a little bit difficult to maneuver um trying to find the size of abaya that you want you have to go to the abaya that you want and then underneath it has the abaya size in you click that and then it shows you what size um they've got some really lovely products on there i bought a really plain one and their prices are really good i paid i think 14 pound 49 for this abaya and paid four pound 49 for this hijab so i'm really pleased with the prices and now i will show you the actual abaya so this is the Abaya, I love it and it was exactly what I wanted basically. I wanted something really plain that you could dress up or dress down. Um, the sleeves I love, I think that's the perfect, you know, sort of width because if you lift your arm up they don't, you know, fall down. Um, the neckline is really high, that's literally the bottom of my neck. There is one pocket. It's not a massive pocket, but you could probably get like a mobile phone in it, but I wouldn't leave the mobile phone in there. This is the length. They said that I probably needed a, I'd need to have the length adjusted, but that is perfect for me because I'm sat down all the time. Dre you know, dresses and things can ride up. So it, when I'm sat down, this, you know, comes to my feet basically. Also, if you wear heels a lot, you're going to want, you know, something a bit longer. 
So I absolutely love it. I think the website was brilliant. You know, it, like I said, it is a little bit difficult to manoeuvre, but you know, you you can get there. The postage prices are really good. I paid about one pound twenty eight for the abaya and the hijab. Like I said, the hijab was. <laughs> Four pound forty nine, and the abaya was fourteen forty nine, and it was exactly what I was looking for. So I'm gonna give them an eight out of ten, purely because I didn't get the responses to my email straight away. But as I said, they didn't, you know, penalise me in any way because I was over my ten days. So yeah, that's my Muslim based review. I will leave links in the down bar. Go and check them out because I think they're really good, especially if you're in the UK. You know, it's good to have a UK company that does really nice abayas and the prices aren't ridiculous. So that's everything, hope everyone is well, be good to each other.